Hello guys, welcome to Dave Tips Update of. I am your coach, Coach Dave, and in this video, you'll be learning how you can set up your Ethereum account. That is how you can set your profile, how you can set your withdrawal um, bank details, and how you can also change your password. So watch this video to the end to get full knowledge about it. Okay, so let's write on. You click on your dashboard after you have inputted your, your login details your username and your password then you bring it to this dashboard then you click on your button. okay so after doing that then first and foremost you have to click on profile there are three different ways you can do that by clicking on profile that is here or you click on this place after you click on that place it will show you a profile a profile there or you can also click on these three dots sorry you can also click on these three dots that is up here you click on it then it will also show you your profile those are the three basic ways you can check out your profile you click on file okay so currently now there are three basic things you can do this is your profile that is where your name your phone number and your country this one is for payment your bank details security if you want to change your password okay so what you do now is to if you want to change your name your full name you can change it here your phone number also you can edit it here then your country also you can edit it here then you click on submit okay so now we, for us to input your bank details you have to go to your account details sorry you have to go to payments it's the same thing go to payment okay then you input I've already done my okay. I've done my already. So you just type in your account number. You just type in your account number. Blah 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 blah. Once you type in your account number, then you select the bank. Okay, ensure you select the bank. So these are the available banks there. So you scroll down to check the available bank. So but the 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 advice the advice was that we should not use my any microfinance bank. You can just use commercial banks. That will be for a faster withdrawal. Don't use microfinance bank okay so you set up put in type in your account number first then you type in the bank name then after you type in once you uh, uh, select the bank i mean once you select the bank then if you stop your name will pop up automatically you don't need to type in your name here okay your name will pop up your will pop up automatically then you confirm it if it is your account name so once you confirm that then you can now click on submit okay so once you have done that so that's how to set up your bank details then when you are withdrawing also confirm the account number and the bank that is there all right so for you to change your password maybe you don't want your upline to log into your account you want to change your password you click on security then you input the old password that is the password you are, you are currently using then you input the new one you want to change it to then you confirm the new password then you click on submit that's how to update that then also if you want to change your profile on ethereum that is this profile that's here you want to change it all you have to do is just to click on this camera image let's say you have one of your beautiful or handsome picture that you want to input you click on the camera image it will load the image of the images you have on your phone then you select any image then after selecting the image because of our time then you click on done so it will just automatically save there all right so let's go back i'm not changing this for now currently okay so also those that are asking that how can you change your currency to dollar or naira so you can see it is currently in dollar for you to do that you click on this dot that is here you click on it then you click on this usd it is currently in usd you can click on it to change it to naira you click on it then you click on naira naira okay you click on naira then you click on ok so after that you can see that it have automatically changed to naira so if those things are popping up you can also cancel them there's a cancel button at that upper part where you can cancel them so let me flash it so i can show you okay you can also if you are following it that is when you can cancel them all. ensure you follow those channels first before you cancel them so you cancel them here all right so that's how to do and navigate navigate through the site thanks for watching this video make sure you like subscribe and share to your audience and your downlines thanks